Hello everyone, I'm Clyde Tilsey. Uh, most of you know me as the uh, color commentator to Eddie Townsend. Uh, he and I get along great. So, um, what I'm supposed to be doing in this video is telling you about uh, how the Green, Horn green Hornets operate. And, uh, you know, it's going to be a little bit difficult for me because how do you evaluate a championship team? Well, here we go. Uh, forwards, you know, you got a wide open talent of Armstrong, Serena, Scott McCants, Joe Mascherin, Chris Asaro, Rick Gallant. You know, I would put Rick Gallant as the uh, face off man. You know, he's got all the talents. Oh, look at that RG. So we'll just say three because, you know, it's sort of like his third season with the Green Hornets, not to be confused with Robert Griffin the third. Uh, you got other talent here, you know, use Neil Armstrong with Gallant, you know, chemistry may be a little bit of an issue there because the two really haven't played with one another, but, you know, they can learn and they can have good talent. You also have, uh, with the other remaining players, you know, give Armstrong some credit, use Scott McCants, they got some good chemistry going as well. You know, McCants and Gallant, they're really awesome together, and on defensively, you know, not a lot of options, but, you know, you've got to go with Tom Buckholz. You know, he's one of the best out there in the league. And not just Buckholz, but go with a Harned, because Frank Harned's got it under his belt. And also another thing you can do, too, is at times whenever Buckholz is not available, you know, use Golgay, because Peter Golgay has some good uh, talent as well from what we've seen from last season. And my pick, if they were ever to try to kill a penalty... You know, I would definitely use Armstrong and McCants together because when they were with the Red Army two seasons ago, they dominated practically every time. You look at the film, it shows there. And the last two teams, you know, personally it's a toss-up. Other players may say Buckholz and whatever. Definitely I would put in Tom Buckholz because that's the way he rolls. You know, he's got the great defense. They don't knock the lights out of anyone. And just to give him some time, I'm going to go ahead and say Steve Byrne on this one. You know, Steve Burns not used a lot, but nevertheless, he's one of those players. So, I guess that's it, basically. You know, again, I'm Clyde Telsey, and uh, hope to see you all there on Sunday.